Zip trunks connect a Mitel Integrated Communications Platform, or ICP, to the public switch telephone network, PSTN, through the internet using voice over IP, also known as VoIP. This provides an anchor point for media streams and protects the switch from malformed messages, unauthorized use and attacks. To configure, in the System Administration tool, click Voice Network. Click Network Elements. Click Add. Enter the name of the SIP provider. For type, select Other. Enter the fully qualified domain name or IP address of the SIP provider. Check the box SIP Peer. Select UDP for SIP Peer Transport. Enter the default of 5060 for SIP Peer Port. Leave all other options set to default. Unless relevant technical documentation indicates to do so, click Save. To verify class of service has been configured for the SIP trunks, go to System Properties, click System Feature Settings, click Class of Service Options. If default class of service options have been imported, go to Class of Service number 55. Verify the class of service is labeled as SIP trunks. The default options for SIP trunks are Station Message Detail Recording or SMDR is enabled and various trunk attributes. To create a trunk attribute number for a SIP trunk, click Trunks. Click Trunk Attributes. Click an available trunk service number. Click Change. For call recognition service, select Trusted. Set direct inward dialing service to on. Enter the class of service number previously created, in our example, 55. Set dial in trunks incoming digits modification absorb to zero. Label the trunk. Click save. SIP peer profiles define carrier specific values and account information. To create a SIP peer profile, click trunks. Click SIP. Click SIP peer profile. Click add. Enter a name for the label. Select the SIP provider. Select IP address. Enter the number for maximum simultaneous calls. This number should be equal to or less than the SIP trunk license you currently have. Go to trunk service. Enter the trunk service number previously created. Click save. For additional information on SIP settings, see our additional videos. For provider-specific configuration information, please refer to the Mitel Interoperability Reference Guide.